I'm Christian, I'm 17 years old, and I'm currently in Coventry at the minute. In Nofa, I play the Euphonium. Um, I've probably been playing Euphonium for around almost 10 years now, which is quite a long while. So the way I got introduced was one of my teachers at a band I, used, I still go to now um, mentioned it to me and asked if I'd want to be involved in an orchestra. Um, so I asked him to nominate me. I'd say it's quite hard to get into an orchestra at a young age, especially if they don't have any audition-based stuff, as I'm pretty sure Nofa might be the only one which is an audition-based, in the UK at least. But I think having that experience of being in the orchestra, playing with like a hundred people, is just a good experience for a musician as it builds your musicality and also just other musical skills. Nofa is like, they always listen to the people that you, inside the orchestra as a lot of, I'd say, even bigger orchestras. The only person with the power is probably the conductor, maybe the concert master, but I'm literally just a person on Euphonium, which a lot of people wouldn't pay attention to, but I've had talks with people to try and see if I can add new repertoire or even conduct the orchestra myself, so I think that's pretty cool. Back when we had baroque classical romantic music a lot of the music then was white composers and white musicians playing it so a lot of the time you'd never see anybody else from different backgrounds in orchestras or composers composing or playing the music so i think now that we have orchestras with more diversity it can also bring new ideas to the orchestra as music from around the world comes in all different ways as in with African drumming rhythm is a lot gives it a lot more empathize and then if we go to Indian music they have different scales which Western music wouldn't even use um, I'll pretty much listen to anything but my main favorite genres are probably more electronic EDM type of stuff there's a different elements in music that I guess just stand out to me a lot, mainly harmony for example, like the, the way harmony just contrasts between dissonance and consonant type of ideas is just really interesting to me. The first one I try to talk about is um, from a game called Hollow Knight which I think is quite interesting as from the seasons which I've played in this is the first time we've done a song from a game which I think it is pretty good as uh, there's a lot of game composers which get a lot of inspiration from orchestral music but you never really hear them played over some of what some of the bigger composers play. And then the other piece called Ghost Town which is from a band which actually originated in Coventry and it, the song talks about like how Coventry was when it went through it's like bad era of just just everything going wrong everything went bad and then it just talks about that time and then the piece which you're doing is basically just an orchestral version of it which is quite interesting because i don't think i would be able to make an orchestral composition of that song well the one main note for highlight that i remember was in this spring term where for the recital evening me and three of the tutors formed like a little jazz ensemble where we played Misty and uh, that's a that's the first time I've actually like performed jazz with a small ensemble as normally I do jazz with like a big ensemble so having that small ensemble feels like a lot more it's a lot more tight in the music but it's a good experience overall, and I think, well, I'd like to say that I had the best performance in the recital evening, but other people may disagree. Well, I'd say the one 
biggest benefit overall is that you will it will help you improve as a musician musicality playing together as an ensemble which is really important as well as developing those skills is very crucial especially if you have a conductor because if you're not used to watching a conductor it probably won't help a lot later on as a musician i say the second biggest um, thing you get from an orchestra is the, so the social part of it as you're most likely going to make new friends and just that social experience like maybe playing with other people in smaller ensembles and that all together is a great experience and for the third I'd say probably the performance the part which most people probably find really nerve wracking but having that like chance to actually perform to people with a big ensemble and having a big sound it's just a really enjoyable thing. It does help a lot of young musicians to move on in their musical ability. As when I first started, I'd say I was terrible at euphonia, but for like the music, the repertoire which they've given me was, especially in the last season with. A young person's guide to the orchestra. That was very challenging, but I'm able to play it now, and I think that challenge is really good as it will help you to improve. And just having that, having something which would inspire young musicians to get on their instrument practice and improve, it just helps overall. <laughs>